Caleb! You okay, man? I'm good, but I'm tired. You don't feel it? We don't have to do this. We can do this later. Bro, shut up, man. Do it now. Good to see you, too. <laughs> Guys, guys, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> guys, welcome back. On this episode of I'm a Grown Man with Multiple College Degrees, we are opening Pokemon cards. If y'all haven't uh, seen, one, Josh is heavy into Pokemon cards, but also the world is heavy into it right now. So I went to a store with Josh yesterday and got a bunch of different cards, and I'm going to be opening them with different friends. These, these are in a pack right now, how do you know that they're PSA 10 in the pack? You don't, that's the thing. After you open them, you have to like, if let's say we get a really good card, there's a possibility of a Charizard in here, which I saw online yesterday sold for like 2200. Whoa. So, there's a possibility of really good cards. You have to take really good care of them and then send them into PSA, which is the grading system. And then they tell you if it's like a nine or 10 or something like that. So you really have no clue. You just hope for the best. What would be like a PSA one? Uh, if you chewed on it. <laughs> Speaking of which, where's Dragon? <laughs> Scott also just ordered some. These were like seven bucks for me. He ordered some like really expensive packs that are coming. So I'm gonna show you the way that Josh taught me how to open them so you can be really careful with them. So you don't wanna just rip a pack open because you know, you can bend a card in doing so. Oh, here comes a cat. Dragon, mm -hmm. I swear to God. The newer ones have this little like thing you show to show that it's authentic. You go one, two, three, four and then put it on the front. But now this means the like best card is the last one. So, energy, <laughs> trainer, Porygon. I don't know half of these to be honest. Krogunk, Krogunk. he's a strong one. <gasps> Pikachu! Pikachu's like, gotta Pikachu. be valuable, it's right? It's gotta be, I don't know from this pack, but I just like Pikachu, so I collect Pikachus, I don't know. Cutie, Cutie fly. Cutie fly. Oh, you're a cutie Sorry. fly. You're a cutie fly. Right. Electro Buzz. So this is what's called a reverse holo, because the rest of the card is holographic and not the picture. Not uh, as expensive, but still still cool to get. You said his name wrong. You said Electro Buzz. That's Electabuzz. Electabuzz. That's before I'm board. So sorry. I don't know. It's like a different version. Okay, last one here. Lucario. I don't know what that is. It is a holo. It's probably not worth much but i'm gonna be opening more pokemon cards on my channel if you guys want to check that out but this oh, yeah. is my first box here on caleb's channel it's a 50 assorted pokemon card box it's kind of like what logan opened right like he was like a hundred fifty thousand dollar box yeah and he yeah, opened all those packs this was 26 dollars on amazon i don't nice. know why everyone's going out spending so much money it, whoa that was kind of sick it was cool it was cool <laughs> but remember what we just said about the grading system Let's do some of this. You take those, I'll take these. Reverse hollow Wismer. Don't know who Wism Wismer is. I actually got my Wismer teeth out recently. So. <laughs> Maybe we should just split these over and be like, see if yeah, we get anything that's... good. Look at all these reverse hollows they do. Are gonna look for like... These are all reverse hollows. I got a Wilmer, a Volpix, an Erica yeah, trainer, very... and a Pignite, all reverse hollows. Look who's here to laugh at us. Boys, I've got mac and cheese and hot dogs. If you want to come in, it's hot. I don't... What is this? What are you playing with? What are these things? Mom, this is all you do. Mom, Mom, they're my Pokemon this cards. This is all you do with the Pokemon cards. Caleb, do you have a family of your own? Because you're here nonstop. Poopymon, Pokemon, whatever it's called. You're going to laugh when we pull a $100,000 card out of here. Oh, no. You'll be laughing because your father's up for tax evasion. You're the one that should be laughing, Caleb. You're the laughing stock of the entire block! Put that show in jail, so have fun visiting him at Walpole State. You two, who cares? You're never gonna be anything! You'll never do anything with your life! I want, You're a loser! I'm gonna be a YouTuber, and then I'm gonna start doing music. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh! Pokemon Pinsir GX 6 out of 68 Hidden Fates Ultra Rare Card. Ultra Rare Ultra Rare Card. $1.99. That's the value. So, Reverse Hollow Trainer. Here we go. It's not gonna be that Charizard. It's not even a Charizard. Is it even holographic? It's not even holographic. What is it? I just wasted $7. That's a month of YouTube. Get down the drain. <laughs> Guys, so as you know, I do have a friend named Ilya. Ilya is a terrible driver. In fact, we've actually made a bet before that I could catch him on camera running a stop sign in his neighborhood that he always runs for $500. So he was like, you'll never catch me running a stop sign again. In this neighborhood. In this neighborhood. In this neighborhood. Those those two stop signs. And we bet how much? 500 bucks. So we made another bet. On camera, double or nothing, that I had six months to catch him running that stop sign in his neighborhood. I finally caught him once. Oh, he did not stop. He didn't stop. But he said it didn't count because I actually had one of my friends follow him. We came to the conclusion that the video had to be my doing by my hand, which is kind of absurd. I really feel like it limited me, but little did Ilya know I had a 
few plans. So I called Ilya, told him that I had a gift for him because of his birthday last week, and I was asking him if he was home. He told me he had a meeting at four o'clock that he had to be at, and that he'd be back sometime around 5.15, so I just knew I had to be in the neighborhood around five. I laid in the back of my trunk, but my car is really orange, so I thought it was gonna stick out, I don't know. Anyway, he ended up coming from the opposite direction of what I was shooting, but then this happened. That is him, that is him, ill, run it. Run it, yo, run it. I went to our friend Ella, a third party. Ella said he for sure ran it. Happy birthday, yo. A white box, helmet, intercom headset. Yeah, so now you oh. don't have to use AirPods. You can call people. Do you know how I knew you were home? How? Oh, no! 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 Kayla! Did you tell him? You No, 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 listen, listen, you listen. It wasn't her, it wasn't her, it wasn't her. It wasn't her, it wasn't her. You told what time you were gonna be oh. home. I didn't even have to camp out that long. So here's a gift, by the way, you owe me $500. <laughs> I mean, that's crazy how like, it's so easy for me to lose. Here's the thing, here's the thing. You make bets that I don't even think you think you'll win. The second bet, I said, okay, how long do I have? You said six months. If I ran like four or five stop signs, my fees wouldn't even accumulate to f***ing. Hey, you're in a triple or nothing at all? <laughs> <laughs> Hey Josh. Hey. Josh took me to the store. He told me to buy this $2,000 pack. So I did. And uh, also too, if you ever go to a store that specializes in Pokemon, don't make Pokemon jokes because they get offended easily. That's my bad again. I'm not allowed to go back with Josh, but. So this is the Hidden Fates pack. There's potential to pull the Charizard that is there, worth. There is a Charizard that's worth some money. I saw one actually sell on eBay two days ago for 1900. Yeah. But it was a PSA 10. Chances of pulling a PSA 10 are very limited, I imagine. Show the thingy, right? Yeah. One, two, three, four. Sabrina's suggestion. Wow. She's so always coming with suggestions. I'm like, Sabrina, stop. You do my own thing. A Metapod, that's worth easily like a thousand dollars, right? Nope. Eevee. People like Eevee and Jigglypuff. Okay, and here it is, moment of truth. I'm gonna show y'all. Here, here, I'm not gonna be here. Anything special? It's a Charizard. No, you're lying. I can tell by that reaction. Okay, Josh. My turn? You can open this one. Okay. Careful, I spent $1,000 on this box. Oh, this one was really bent. Yeah, there actually was a little bit of bend in the corners there. Oh, that's not we got energy. Brock. Brock's grit. Chansey. Graveler. <laughs> Coughing. <laughs> Magikarp. I like Magikarp. Turns into... Gyarados. Roulette. Wait. Hollow, did I mess this up? Wow, I got a hollow and a rare. I don't totally know how it fits work. I haven't opened that much of it, but yeah, I got a hollow card. Cassie, hang up the phone. Here, you can have this. An energy card. A jigglypuff. A jigglypuff. I love a jigglypuff. Oh my goodness gracious. This family. And then her little snack corner. <laughs> That, hold on. Hold oh, we have on. a seven year old working in here, guys. No. We got a Pokemon card shop with the a Jimmy Puff. We got all of our sugar snacks in the corner. We, we have a frozen binder over here. Hey, but you know what? Anytime you have trash, you just throw it away into the basket. <laughs> yeah, there's a seven year old working in here. Oh, I almost forgot her Harry Potter collection. 